Hello and welcome back to the channel and now you join me for this week's Forza Long Guide called It's Like Fiat which wants you to own and drive the 1980 Fiat 124 Sport Spider to complete all of those challenges with. So let's get stuck in. Now this is a 1980 Fiat 124 Sport Spider, and it can only be purchased from the auction house for 25,000 credits or you might get one a little cheaper in the auction house. I've also created a tune for you guys to use, it's called Forzathon, the share code is on your screen there, 755-984-369. Now the first challenge here is nice and easy and it wants you to earn a total of three stars at speed traps. So the one I picked is the Paso Inferior and the reason I picked this one even though it's on a dirt road is because it has very low scores for one, two and three stars. Now the easiest way to do this is probably just to get one star or two stars going one way and the same going the other way if you're using this tune as it's just a normal rear wheel drive with the standard engine tuned up a little bit. However if you've got something more like a four wheel drive tune or whatever uh, it might be easy just to get three stars on one run but it's a nice and easy speed trap and a simple first challenge now the next challenge here simply wants you to win a road race so to do this we're going to head over to the uh, arch of mulahay circuit where i have as you saw there a race set up for you guys to use it's one lap with no ai driver tasks so you're guaranteed to win every single time and an easy way to pass this challenge now we're going to move on to the final one, which wants you to earn a total of 95 mile an hour at speed traps, which again is super easy to do. So to do this, we're going to hit the autopista uh, speed trap, which is of course on the highway. Now you don't necessarily need a long run up. It just depends on what tune you've got. Even the standard car will hit over 100 mile an hour, but this is a good one if you do need a long run up to get, uh, as it's got obviously pretty much all of the motorway in order for you to get up to speed, but an easy final challenge to finish on there. Now, hopefully this guide has helped you out. If it has, I'd very much appreciate if you could drop a like. Uh, and if you're new to the channel, subscribing massively helps me out as well. Also, if you're struggling with anything, please do let me know down below in the comments. I'm more than happy to help you guys out. But apart from that, I want to thank you very much for watching. Make sure you stay safe and take care.